Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Mark, and I'm back here today with another video. Today, I'll be reviewing a shoe company called DVS. Definitely hyped to talk about them. They are definitely one of the OGs, and so I'm really excited to talk about them, guys. I'll be reviewing a shoe called the Rico SC, so let's get into it. Okay, guys, right off the bat, let's get into it. So we got the box here. We got DVS Rico SC, size 9 on the side. Got it on the other side, black on black colorway. We've got the DVS logo on the top. And we got DVS here, as well as DVS Footwear Company, right there, as you guys can see. Okay, so let's look to the inside. Looking on the inside, we got the normal DVS tissue wrapping paper for the shoes. A notable thing to know that comes with the shoes was a sticker. And just to let you know, for a good time, go to dvsshoes.com. So that was kind of sick that they threw in a sticker, guys. Um, so I'm actually filming this video twice because uh, after I put these shoes on I realized a lot of stuff that I know I want to include in this video for you guys so Let's get into it. Here we go. This is the DVS Rico SC Size 9 black on black colorway and there's some uh, hits of gray as well So guys during this review I'm just also gonna be throwing in some facts about DVS since uh their shoe review, their shoe a company that's not reviewed much anymore or like really bought much anymore. They're going down. That's kind of one of the big reasons why I got this shoe was because I wanted to try them out um, before this company possibly goes under. So hopefully this goes for good for them. They get some coverage with it. You guys all enjoy this and everybody can see what it's like. So let's look towards the inside. We got the Chico DVS skateboarding. On the sides of this shoe, it is mesh, so it's going to be great for breathability. To be noted, this insole is not removable, so that has to be noted. So most skate shoes nowadays have removable insoles. This one does not, but it is a little bit cushioned, so it's not horrible by any means. But just let it be known. So if you see that, I can't take it out. Besides that, it's pretty good. Uh, good insole, so it's probably like a 7 out of 10. Looking towards the fit of this shoe, it is one of the most low top shoes I've ever skated. Very, very low cut. Uh, there's some padding in the heel, and you, can, you can't really see it, but you can kind of see right there how it comes out a little bit right there. So there's a little bit of heel uh, padding going around, so that's really good on the collar too. Tongue, we got the DVS logo, and it is a leather tongue with holes in it for breathability. Um, it's super flat. There's no padding there. We have one, two, three, four, five eyelets running up the top of the shoe. The top one is a metal one that says DVS skateboarding. Right here we got a DVS tag, very low key shoe. The shoe is very low profile. The stitching here is stitched on the inside so it can't rip. Looking towards the bottom, we have a black on um, black bottom and there is a little bit of an instep with this shoe. You can see it says DVS shoe company right here but yeah so there's a little bit of an instep and so i mean it arches over right there and it also curves a lot right here um so this is a very interesting shoe so some of the things i wanted to talk about that i realized after i put the shoe on was that this shoe is very tight fitting i got a size nine and i'm usually comfortable in all the shoes i get uh they're usually enough room and not too tight but this one is very tight so if you do not like tight shoes you might want to go half size up in the rico sc uh, hopefully it's not going to be too bad. You know, I always think I'd rather have a shoe that fits too tight than too loose. So we'll see how that is, but definitely want to give everybody a heads up. Definitely be aware of this very low cut profile. Um, it's really low cut, so you got to get used to it. But I had put it on my foot and it feels great. Like I don't feel like it's going to fall off or anything. So, uh, don't be worried about that. Other things I want to talk about is the suede on this shoe is really great. You guys might not be able to tell on all the most high def camera, but this is some really great suede. So they actually put really good material into this. And the other thing I wanted to talk about was the shape of the shoe is very pointy. So this shoe is going to be a lot different if you haven't had one of these like really slim back type shoe with a very pointy front. I have never really tried this, so I'm excited to try it out, guys. Here is the other one. Um, so yeah, be aware of that. So hopefully it's gonna have great thick and it gets pretty thin right here Actually, it thins it, th it thickens towards the heel and thins out towards the front So be aware of that and there is a little bit of patterns in there if you want to see that I'll show that towards the front. You can check that out 
And then looking towards the bottom, the bombs are great. The soles look awesome, so I'm excited to try these out. Look super sticky. DVS right there, DVS logo. So yeah, guys, those are the things I wanted to tell you about that I forgot, so we got all into it. Um, yeah, guys, I will let you know how these are, and I'll definitely be back with another video. If you have any questions, drop them below, and I will definitely uh, answer them. If you have any other thoughts, let me know. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.